In uh, early 2016, we received a citizen tip that uh, individual had uh, in their possession an original Charles Darwin letter. And through our investigation, we were able to determine that the letter itself was stolen um, late 1970s uh, from the Smithsonian by a former employee. After receiving the citizen tip, um, we were able to recover the letter immediately from, uh, from the individual that had the letter. Um, and then uh, furthermore, we were able to determine through some research, uh, the Cambridge Project, that the letter itself belonged to the Smithsonian Archives. And then today, it's uh, delivery to its final resting place, its home here at the Smithsonian Archives in Washington, D.C. Thank you for the partnership. Mm. Well, thank you very much. We are so grateful and so appreciative of the work that you do. Um, the fact that the letter that we were able to recover was dated back to 1875 so has some serious um, historic significance. Art itself is what really defines our society as being civil and its return is, uh, has, a, has a pretty remarkable feeling um, for us as investigators. This letter to Mr. Hayden, Fernand Hayden, thanking him for some geological work that he had done, uh, sharing information, scientific information with Charles Darwin, and the fact that we get to return that letter to its rightful owner, it feels pretty awesome. <laughs>